Hey everyone, this is a medium combat achievement guide for squashing the giant. This is a free to play friendly guide and it involves killing Obor using the snare kiting method whilst protecting from missiles. Let's dive right in. The main requirements to complete this combat challenge on free to play consists of having a brass key, 40 prayer for protect from missiles, 50 magic for the snare spell, your best possible free to play magic gear, it's recommended you have access to fire blast if possible with 59 magic, 45 prayer for mystic might, and your inventory will consist of 20 anchovy pizzas, runes for stamp fire blast, teleportation runes, giant key and brass key. You can see here I've made a little map guide with how to get there. So you head west from Varric West Bank when you have your inventory sorted. You head past the cooking guild and then you head a bit northwest up to Edgeville Dungeon where you use the brass key on the door to enter in. And then you go down the ladder which will then put you into the Edgeville Dungeon. Just a little gear check here. So this is going over if you use Briar Feeder Staff or Staff of Fire. You'll notice a 5 plus magic de attack decrease um, with using the Fire Staff, but it sh I didn't notice it much, but you might if you lower magic. All right, so now we're heading uh, west from the Varric West Bank, um, as seen on the map. Uh, getting there, this is a journey you'll you'll find. I'm using walk um, to preserve run energy, and I recommend you do that because obviously with free to play you don't have access to you know stamina potions and that sort of thing. Um, just a bit over the gear side of things, we're going over quickly. Um, I am using the bright feeder staff for this kill to get get the challenge done. Um, this is over 8 mil currently, so you might, if you're free to play, you might not want to use that. And I do have the fire room, uh, sorry, fire staff uh, guide in there too. Um, but yeah, I'm basically wearing this setup of, of half wizard robes, Zami monk robe bottom with the anti uh, fire, fire anti dragon shield, I should say, and the magic amulet. So we've entered Obor's lair, and now what you want to do is you want to wait till he's far south facing. Make sure your run energy is activated and you've got protect from missiles before you enter the lair. And you snare as soon as you can. Don't let him attack you with melee. So you can see here I've got a safe distance. Activate Mystic Might if you do have 45 prayer at this point. What you will notice is I'm using these corners and if he does get closer, as long as you get the snare off when you're running back, even if he's one tile away, if you get it, uh, this, if you cast snare before he's one tile away, it won't register with a melee attack, but it will if, you'll know you've stuffed it up if it registers, um, you know, he attacks you one tile away when you do it, then you will fa fail the challenge. Yeah, so just keep using your corners, get into the rhythm of two to three spells, uh, distant dependent, and then uh, run back or sideways to cast snare. It's much easier doing it that way. And you'll see here the finish is pretty easy. Congratulations, squashing the giant has been completed and you got yourself a pretty decent free to play achievement I reckon. Now for you free to play players out there that don't have access to 8 mil for the Bright Feeders staff, this is a fire staff run. You'll notice that it takes a little bit longer, um, we won't be using Mystic Might either so I'm assuming you won't have that. but. It's the same case, you just got to wait for Obor to make his way far south of this, uh, of his lair. Can take some time sometimes, so just be patient. Here we go. Act make sure protect from missiles activated. 
don't be a doofus like me and uh, have auto attack on. Alright, so here we go. So we got the snare happening, got run energy activated before heading in. Should have went over that. But we're basically doing the same same system of running with your corners, um, snaring in place, one to you know, two to three magic attacks. Sometimes if it's closer, uh, dependent, it'll just be two attacks. So just just uh make sure you just get the snare off that's the main thing doesn't matter how long it takes you should have enough prayer points to be able to do it as long as you have like 40 prayer for protect from missiles yep so i'm just getting space again You'll notice for this kill, something interesting happens here. He actually comes up and it looks like you might think it's a melee attack, this next one, but it's actually his arrange attack from one square away. Ready? So you get the snare and he uses, well it's not one square away is it, but it looks that here he, he does a range attack, but you'll still complete it even if he does that attack. So, nice work. Thanks everyone for watching this medium combat achievement guide. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm still currently making some more. If you have any suggestions of ones you want me to complete, just give me a bell and I'll try and do them. I had a bit of fun doing this one actually, being free to play, locked, it was interesting. If you are an Iron Man though, I didn't go through how to get the keys and things like that, but maybe another guy I might. My name is Obor, and as I sit in my lair, I wonder, does anyone have the courage to be squashing the giant?